welcome to the FPX Nickel YouTube channel. Uh, my name is Martin Turen. I'm the company's president and CEO, and I'm joined again today by our chairman and co-founder, Peter Bradshaw. Peter, it's nice to see you again. Yeah, good morning, Marty. So we're here today to describe the and discuss the results of a news release put out on January 6th, 2022 by the company. That reports the final results of the maiden drill program at the Van Target. Uh, which is a very interesting target and a new discovery that has been made by the company um, this year. As we can see, the Van Target is located approximately six kilometers north of our Baptiste deposit. Baptiste, as we know, is one of the world's largest undeveloped nickel deposits. Um, and so the initial drill program at Van was really designed to understand whether Van could potentially host a deposit uh, similar in scale or, and or tonnage than what we've seen historically at Baptiste. And in fact, those results uh, have confirmed a new discovery here at Van. So in October, we released the results of Van Holes 1 and 2. Uh, we then followed that up in November with a release describing uh, further conformatory holes in Van Holes 3 and 4. And the results of the January, in January 6th, described the, um, the results of Van Holes 5 to 7 here in the West, as well as 8 and 9 in the East. So I'll pass it over to Peter now to talk through some of the sections and what we're seeing in the in the geology and the mineralization here at Van. Okay, okay, thanks, Marty. So if we start with with the the, the western most section, so the one we, we just released five five six seven, the results are on on the screen here. But oh, oh, overall, a, a very interesting trend to, to, to observe is if you if you look at the northernmost hole num, num, number seven there are reasonable grades at, at, at the top and they are de de declining as, as you go down hole if, if you, you move a bit further south to, 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 to six the, the, the grades improve and are thicker uh, Further, further downhill, uh, down hole in hole six, and then if if you go to, to the last hole five, the the, the good grade material is, is even better grade, and for a a longer stretch down down the hole, de describing a, a a very consistent trend of improving. Grade and and uh, thickness as you go to the south. If, if you if you go to the to the to, to the next section, uh, four to to the north and three to the south, you you you, you get exactly the, the, the you know the same trend, uh, and, and you you can see, for instance, that the top of three has one hundred and forty three three meters of the point one four three DTR nickel. Which is significantly above the to the average grade for uh, for Baptiste, and if if you go, you go to the to the to the next section, um, one one and and and, and two and again you you get exactly the same the same trend the the grade in increases and the the good grade gets gets thicker as you go to, to the south. No, yeah. yeah, yeah. So we we are seeing that trend there. Sorry, sorry, Peter, to, to to interrupt you there. We're seeing that trend of mineralization typically getting higher in 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 its nickel content as you move south. Just another visualization here. And again, these models are available on our website uh, for people to kind of play around with in more detail, um, and uh, also to understand the sort of the positioning of the drill holes in relation to some of that historical outcrop samples that are shown by the colored blocks here. Just returning, I guess, to our overall plan map that shows the location of the nine holes that were drilled in the kind of the, let's say the central and the Eastern part of the target. What kind of conclusions can we kind of draw from the results of the, 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 the nine holes that were drilled this summer, Peter? Well, based on, on this, this drilling, there, there, there's a very clear trend of increasing grade and thickness to the to to the south, and that's all based on uh, originally based on on outcrop. That's why the samples the drill holes were put in in that lo location. To 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 the south, 
the area is covered with with, with, with overburden, and and we have no outcrop to to, to rely on. But quite quite clearly, there's a prospective trend in in, in in that direction. Also, if if you look if you look to the west, we we have some some, some very solid outcrop samples there. And um, you know, which it extends the perspective area in, in that in, in that direction. But then the group just shown in, in, in orange is is perspective, but I, a, a little more uh, speculative. Yeah, I think that's well said, Peter. So um, I, I think overall, this has been a pretty exciting campaign and a very excellent result for us uh, to to really have made this new discovery at Van. It gives us a lot of opportunity, I think, to um, see what we can expand here in field seasons to come. And we'll be very excited to get back in the field and to expand these drill programs to ultimately, you know, potentially moving this towards a, a mineral resource estimate in the full fullness of time. So, Peter, uh, thanks again for uh, participating. Um, I hope that uh, people find these videos helpful. For anyone with questions, please leave them below the video or feel free to email me directly at ceo at fpxnickel.com. Uh, until the next time, uh, thanks to everyone and, and Happy New Year. Happy New Year, everyone.